usalama wa ndani Profesa Kidhure Kindiki ametetea operesheni inayoendelea kuwasaka na kuwanasa majangili wanaohangaisha watu katika kaunti sita za bonde la Ufa. Kauli ya Kindiki imejiri wakati watu wanne wameuawa na mawezi wa mifugo katika maeneo ya Lai Samis na Samburu na kama anavyoarifu Stephen Letoni kwamba kufikia sasa bunduki 42 zimesalimishwa kwa polisi. Ali imesalia tete katika kijiji cha Korale eneo bunge la Laisamis County ya Marsabit baada ya majangili kuvamia kijiji hicho usiku wa kwamkia leo na kuwaua watu watatu na kutoroka na mamia ya mifugo miongoni mwa waliouawa ni watoto wawili walio na umri wa miaka tatu na miaka saba katika shambulizi hilo watu wawili waliachwa na majeraha mabaya the most painful thing is is the killings wa babarik barbaric killing you know when you have a small boy of six years old that we had in the past incident happened a month ago where eight people were killed the same thing happened to these people today where a small girl of maybe five years old who has no breast they cut the breast and take it the small part the, the boy's private parts are taken they are cut and taken brutality of the assaults eyes are gouged out katika kaunti jirani ya Samburu hali si hali wakazi wanaishi kwa wasiwasi baada ya mtu mmoja kuwawa na majangili usiku wa kwamkia leo katika kijiji cha Pura siku tu sisi tunalia kila siku tu sisi tunalia watu wamehama kabisa hakuna watu kwa pora sahi nyinyi mnasema mnalinda watu mnasunguka usiku kwani nyinyi mnaenda kulala ama nyinyi mnaambia watu walale ama, a, 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 watu wanakuja wanaingilia watu wanaua watu kila wakati watu wako na shida tumetembea katika hizo ofisi sote ofisi ya kindiki tumeenda mara mingi kwa president tumekuwa kwa ofisi ya IG tumekuwa lakini hatuwezi kuendelea kufunga macho na watu wanaendelea kufa kila siku. Matukio hayo yamejiri wakati ambapo waziri wa usalama Profesa Kinduki Kithure alihojiwa na kamati ya seneti kuhusu operesheni ya kiusalama bonde la Ufa ambapo kaunti sita zinazidi kushuhudia utovu wa usalama. Waziri Kindiki akisema kuwa operesheni hiyo itaendelea hadi pale usalama utakaporejea maeneo hayo. That operation might last I don't know how long maybe a few months. But we are not going to withdraw the presence of security agencies even after the operation. That deployment is going to be permanent as long as Kenya exists. Kindiki akisema kuwa majangili hao wataadhibiwa kama magaidi. The desire of the Kenya Cancer Administration is to make sure that we eradicate livestock rustling and banditry permanently Tangu operesheni hiyo kwanza bunduki 42 zilizokuwa mikononi mwa raia zimesalimishwa kwa maafisa wa usalama huku msako wa kutoa bunduki zaidi ukiendelea Steven Leto Runinga ya Citizen